Hi everyone, Bandana here. I hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to the RTS Cast and Stuff channel. Remember to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, especially if you'd like to see more videos like this one. Welcome back to Warno, and welcome to what is going to be a short cast. Let's not beat around the bush here. What I'm about to show you is how you're going to get ELO in under five minutes. It's disgusting. I mean, it is truly disgusting. I'm going to open this up. This isn't to name and shame. This is not at all to name and shame. In the blue corner, we have Comrade Kermit playing as the 82nd Airborne. And in the red corner, we have Royce playing as the 35th. Obviously not the best division at the moment. But Royce, not the worst player in the world, certainly not. And this is no offence to Royce in his playstyle. We're not playing who's going to win or lose here. It's not that kind of game. Royce is about to get decimated. That's what, there's no other way to put this. Royce is about to get decimated. Comrade Kermit, let's have a look at what he has down. So, the new Lavs, three of them over here, and one of the M551 ACAVs. Remember, this is the Sheridan version of the ACAV. It is not the big fancy M1A1. And then the Lav is obviously the new unit with that nice auto cannon on top. Obviously very fast getting to the front line because it's wheeled. Over here we've got some airborne scouts, we've got some airborne, we've got a Kiowa warrior which is heading up to the front there, and here again we have three lavs and one of those akavs. And that's all that's down there. And that tells me something else. Either Comrade Kermit hasn't spent all their points, or they've bought some aircraft. Can you see where this is going? And over here, in the red corner, Royce playing as the 35th. We've got SPG-9 heading up to the front there. We've got more SPG-9 squads heading up. We've got some Igla squads. We've got a Rio stat. We've got an SPG-9 going up to the middle there, looking for a defensive lockdown. Back here, we have an MI-2T with a 12.7mm machine gun squad in there. That's totally random, but okay. Over here, we have... Lots of Desenikis in BMD2s. We have a ZU-23. So we do have some kind of AA over here. We've got a couple of SPG-9s, an Igla, and another Desenikis in a BMD. We've got a BRDM-2 there. And somewhere in this mess, we also have a command, I'm sure. There is a command somewhere in there. Yes, I can just see the command in there. Let's get the show on the road, shall we? I've even plugged in the controller for this one. Because it still feels relevant. So. Basically what we're looking for is what Comrade Kermit is doing. And as I say, this is truly disgusting. But you know, if you want some quick ELO, and the one way to get Eugen to fix it is uh, for everyone in the rank ladder to complain about it. Two A-10 rockets, something you don't see very often these days. And an F-15C Eagle coming in. No jet from the other side. Obviously the F-15C would scare that off anyway most likely. You need a couple of jets to be dealing with this mess coming in. 1A10 rocket each side of the map. And here's all these units charging down towards the front. A-10 rocket peeling off to this side. Here they come. And there it goes. Everything. All the AA, everything. Absolutely annihilated. Get wrecked. Welcome to Ranked Warner. Oh, we're not done yet. Here comes the MiG-29. Oh, but there's the 15. In it goes. Insta-kill. F-15 still dancing around. A-10 rocket going back in for another pass. Dishing out some more damage. No losses as yet for Comrade Kermit. Multiple losses for Royce. Royce is ticking up some points, but does it matter? Is this game still going? Or is it over? It's a rough start. Losing half your units. A-10 still in play. Eagle decides it's time to leave.
But the damage is done. MiG-29 coming in, looking for a kill on that A-10. Is there an answer to this? A-10's not looking great. Takes another hit. Another Eagle's on the way in. Eagle going straight in for the MiG-29. And there it is. The kill has been made. The A-10 got out alive. Barely, but it got out alive. And Comrade Kermit was still pushing. And Royce very fairly surrendered there. I cannot blame him at all. Look at that. 1,220 kills. Zero losses. Isn't that just disgusting? Isn't it just disgusting? I will note that Comrade Kermit felt very ashamed of what they had done here. And uh, did it to prove a point. And I think the point was proven. I'll let you argue about that in the comments. Is that stoppable? Is it not? How would you have to completely adjust your opener to stop that? I, I think you need multiple aircraft. Could you change the AA? With a different division? Kind of curious. If anyone else has a go of that, please do let me know the results. I'd be very curious. There you go. Now that's a short video and a short cast. Thanks for watching everyone. I'll see you all soon.